Managing inventory is easy from any device. Tapping on our inventory tab here, sellers can see their entire item library and stock counts in the stock overview. You can search by item name, scan a barcode, search a SKU number, and you'll be able to see what you have in on-hand inventory in real time, as well as what you have on order. Tap into an item. You'll also be able to manage stock in this screen. So if you ever need to adjust stock uh, by receiving, doing a recount, marking items as damage, theft, loss, or restock return. Also on the stock overview, you can receive stock in by scanning in items, searching those items, and adding your counts. When receiving, we can also update any unit costs if there are fluctuating unit costs. And once those items are received, inventory will automatically update, and we can even print barcode labels for those items that we just created. Stock counts are available on all iOS devices running our Square for Retail point of sale app. You can use the iPad or iPhone camera as a barcode scanner as well. And we can complete full counts as well as partial counts. Those counts do go in for review. And in the review, you are able to see what's expected in inventory versus what was actually counted, the variance in count, and the variance in cost. Once that review is confirmed, your inventory will automatically update. Sellers can create purchase orders and email them right to their vendors from the point of sale. So in our purchase order overview screen here, we can create our purchase order. We select our vendor that we are ordering from. This is where you can scan or search items that you want to add to that purchase order. We'll select the quantity that we are ordering. If you do need to update unit costs, you can do it in this screen. You can add an expected date on when you expect to receive that delivery, add any taxes, create that purchase order. That purchase order will then get sent directly via email to your vendor. And once that purchase order is received, we are able to mark those items as received and inventory will automatically update. We can also mark purchase orders as partially received as well. Once received, we can also print barcode labels directly from a purchase order. Transfer orders are here. If there are any transfers between locations, you are able to transfer inventory. And metrics, just a quick snapshot of the last 30 days. This will give you your total cost of goods sold, revenue, profit, and profit margin. Mm -hmm.